chance later tonight into tomorrow morning for our northeast communities. But, you know, most of us are going to stay dry. And yesterday it was nice. Today's been nice. Check out this photo of the Market Street Bridge downtown Chattanooga. You can see the aquarium. You got Lookout Stadium and Lookout Mountain. This was taken by William, William Odell. I appreciate you sending that in. He said he's a lifetime Chattanooga and taking some good photos yesterday. And here's a look at your temperatures. Again, it is really cool for this time of the year in the Carolinas. I mean, 57 in Charlotte. They have all that rain coming in as that low pressure works inland. But here locally, we're in the 70s. I mean, pretty much across the board. Very comfortable northeast winds at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Look at that lower 70s in Murphy and Blue Ridge. You can't beat it for late May. And here's a look at your Skywatcher reports. A handful of 70s, Soddy Daisy did manage 81. Bryan, Alabama also in the 80s today, but most areas topping out in the mid to upper 70s. Doug and Delano had 78, Rossville 77, and Leslie atop Signal Mountain had 75 degrees. Been down in Somerville right at 81. So it's been a mild day, but here's a look at the cloud cover from earlier. Again, the sun setting on the East Coast are it's gradually going to begin setting here over the next little bit. You can see the visible imagery just showing a lot of cloud cover off to our east as this low pressure works inland, but you know, it's nice here in the Tennessee Valley. Been a really nice Saturday for us. All the rain staying to our east, which was kind of the thinking moving into your Memorial Day weekend. Now we could have a couple of these showers try to move into our eastern zone as this low pressure continues to track inland, but you know, not anticipating too much in the way of rain. Here's a look at your future cast. Again, a lot of the shower activity stays into the Carolinas. A little bit of cloud cover kind of increasing for our northeastern communities as we go into tonight and early Sunday. And if we're going to have any rain from this system, them maybe Sunday morning into Murphy, maybe Athens, but it's going to be a pretty sharp cutoff and a lot of us are going to stay dry with some cloud cover early and then we'll just have a mix of sun and clouds as we continue through your Sunday. So overall, other than I would say a 20% chance of rain or so for your Sunday, things are looking good and even Monday going to be dry as well for your Memorial Day festivities. So here's a look at future cast rainfall. Again, not a whole lot going on here. Maybe a tenth of an inch in spots. You can see that really sharp cutoff. And right now it looks like most of our area really not going to be dealing with the rain. Again, the highest amount is going to be into the Carolinas, which was what we were thinking. You can kind of see that break in the rain. And over the next several days, again, not too much in the way of rain chances for us here in the Tennessee Valley. Monday, Tuesday looking dry. Wednesday, maybe a slim chance of a shower and then just some isolated activity as we close out Thursday, Friday into Saturday. But for tonight, the big story going to be the cool air. I mean, this time of year, this is well below average for one. I mean, some areas are going to be in the 40s with the northeast wind at 5 to 10. You might need to break out the light jacket late tonight or early tomorrow and then going into your Sunday. It'll be 76, partly cloudy. Again, a few spotty showers for our northeastern communities. A nice breeze out of the northeast once again. Overall, going to be a nice Sunday. We bumped up the temperatures a little bit. We should top out in the mid 70s, but again, that's about 10 degrees below normal for this time of the year. And as we take a look at your seven day forecast, again, Memorial Day on Monday looking fantastic. Fantastic. We'll have some sunshine, a few clouds around highs near 80, 83 on Tuesday, and then the heat and humidity build up by the end of next week with a few showers through Saturday, Cornelia. Well, not too